Hi, my crafty friends. Y'all, I have the coolest project. So I picked up a pack of straws from the Dollar Tree. Now these are the non-bendy straws, which by the way, are a little difficult to find these days. Some all seem to be bendy. But anyways, there's 150 in the package and we are going to make two outdoor ornament decorations with these. So what I'm doing, I'm just using this little glass jar just to kind of hold all of them in place because I'm going to use a zip tie to wrap around there. Now there's not a lot of um, the tail, I call it, of the zip tie left to hold on to. Um, so what I ended up doing is, you know those things that you can put around jars to like, you know, open them so you can get a good grip? <laughs> well, that's what I end up using to help me hold on to that end of the zip tie. And what I do is I just pull it as hard as I can and down as far as I can because these are going to be like big, huge, uh, spiky ornaments. Y'all, I love to decorate my front porch. I love to have a Christmas tree out there and I love to make my own ornaments. So this is going to be um, a great addition to that. So once I kind of get it pulled as, as long or as, uh, you know, as much as I can, then what I start doing is just kind of um, moving all the straws around and kind of where the center parts are all kind of clumped together. I just kind of pull them apart and just kind of try to make them as even-ish as possible. So here's the second one. I love that we get two out of one pack um, of the of the straws. So the straws, one pack of straws and a couple of zip ties and some spray paint and we are good to go on this project. Um, I have a really cool another idea to do for some outdoor, um, I think I'm gonna put two trees on my porch this year. I'm gonna do one in like traditional red and white. And then the other one, I want it to look like kind of, you know, um, like the candy kind of um, gumdrops, kind of all that kind of stuff. I have one for that too. So that one's coming up soon. But anyways, once I get, like I said, once I get this all tightened down as far as I can, then I kind of just start bending everything into, you know, so it's all kind of fluffed all around there. So then we're going to take it outside and we are going to uh, spray paint it. And I kind of had to do this in sections. I kind of did the top and the sides, let that dry, and then flipped them over and did the same thing because I just wanted to make sure that all of the white was covered there. And um, easy peasy got all dried up because it was nice and sunny. So um, another thing is we could cut these if you don't want them to be as long like we could do the long ones like this and then half the straws Ooh, that's a good idea good thing I got two packages of straws <laughs> Um, but that would be super fun to do as well. And I was even thinking spray painting these gold would be amazing home decor. All right, friends, here's how they turned out. I cannot wait to put them on my tree. Okay, it is a little too early to put them on the tree outside, but that's okay. All right, friends, thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow for more.